guys another opportunity to go race. No points, money, anything like that, but these guys just get out there, get the experience that they need. Green flag is in the air. Off turn number two, they will go for the very first time. Jake Duper, your pole sitter, the number 2D. Inside of Kyle Devendorf's number five, side by side, they'll go to turn number three and four. Devendorf with a little bit of a bobble, goes way up the hill, opens the door to the inside, had to get back onto the throttle as he came off the top of turn number four. But Devendorf is gonna pay off as he'll go to the front of the field, one car around. AJ Martino getting, getting twisted in a knot. Chad Balance is going to slide way off the top of turn number one and two. Both cars facing the wrong direction over here in that turn number one and two. AJ Martino right in the middle of the racetrack to the top side. So one lap in the book here in the limited sportsman features. We get ready to go back at it here in just another couple of laps. Well, so next time around, we get ready to go back to green. He said one lap complete, 15 lap feature action here for the limited sportsman track safety lights going off. Your leader is Kyle Devendorf in the number five machine. Jacob Duper settling into the number two spot. Brassier is able to slide up into that third position. Fire Swamp outside him in the 88. Swamp started back in seventh. Couple of feature wins under his belt already for the 14 year old out of Hogansburg, New York. Way up there in the North Country. Brett Sears is going to start in that third spot on the inside. Regala holds on to spot number five. Stevenson outside him as we get ready to go back to green flag racing action. Down to turn number three and four. Green is back in the air. A couple of cars are going to get tangled up over here in turn number one and two again. Ryan Regala, the number R1 machine. Tyler Stevenson's number two in the 29 of Chad Balance all getting hooked together and spinning and sliding off the top of the speedway. Regala able to drive away. Looks like Chad Balance will get the number 29 fired back up for the second time. Balance is taken off the speedway by cars pinning in front of the 29er. Tyler Stevenson over there piloting the Chris Thurston number two machine gets the car fired up off the top side of the speedway over there. It's very wet when you get out into that field. We'll get a good look at it here on our replay one more time. This just outside the top five going down into turn number one and two. So track safety lights should be going off very quickly here. We've got to keep an eye if they've got the number two of Tyler Stevenson back out onto the speedway. Stretch, pace truck, we get ready to go back to green. Kyle Devendorf, your leader. Jacob Duper, second. Third spot will belong to Brett Sears. Green flag is back in the air. Devendorf's going to get a good start in that number five. He'll drive off turn number two. Now Brett Sears is going to slide the nose underneath Jacob Duper's number two day is at two D as they work off turn number two down the back stretch. Fire swap to the inside, trying to take the spot away from the 82 as they go into turn number three and four. Down the back stretch continues to be. That battle now, Fire Swamp able to slide out in front of Jacob Duper's number two machine. Duper coming through into that next spot. They swing off turn number three and four. Brett Sears back out trying to reel in. Your leader, Kyle Devendorf, down to turn number one and two. Sears is in that number two spot, followed by Fire Swamp as they work off turn number two down the back stretch. Battle shaping up right now as they go to turn number three and four. Up the hill goes the number 42 machine. That belongs to Jason Lopes. He had company, and now they're going to get together. And Chad Balance, one more time, is going to get involved. Ryan Regal is number one, the R1, and Chad Balance 
Those two cars have been together in all three cautions here. The 42 of Jason Lopes also involved as Lopes got spun around. The track safety lights going off again. Uh, Kyle Devendorf, your early leader in the number five machine, getting ready to fire from the inside of row number one. Lane choice is his. Brett Sears sits outside him. Inside row number two, that is the 88 of Fire Swamp. As we said, a couple of feature wins under his belt here at Can-Am in the 2020 racing season. Out of turn number three and four, green flag will be in the air. Off turn number two, they will dance one more time down the backstretch. Steven Dorf, your leader, out in front, will take them down into turn number three and four. Brett Sears just sitting a couple of spots back from him now as they work off turn number four down the front stretch here. Fire Swamp's going to get up and take a spot away as they head down into turn at number three and four this time. Off turn number two, they will dance down the backstretch. Off turn number two, down the back stretch, he will go dive. Kyle Devendorf out in front of the field. Brett Sears settles into that number two position. He'll go down into turn number three and four, but right now Devendorf trying to stretch that advantage out in front of the field. Fire Swamp holding on to spot number three as they swing off turn number four. Herzog chases him down the turn number one and two this time. Nyer trying to improve his spot. He'll go to the inside of Jacob Duper off turn number two. And Eric Nyer, a lot of sheet metal damage, but he'll race his way back up into the top five. Down to turn number three and four. They will go cross flags are coming out. We are halfway home this time. It will be Kyle Devendorf stretching that advantage out in front of the field. Sears right now comfortably into the number two spot. Fire Swamp holding on to that third position. Here's a battle shaping up now as Herzog's caught his back bumper. Herzog looks to the outside, comes up along the 88 of Swamp. They're going to be side by side, turn number three and four. Herzog now switches it, comes down to the inside, looks to the inside, I should say, off turn number four. Couldn't quite get there. Swamp able to hold him off as they go down into turn number one and two. Swamp right through that black stuff off turn number two. We're able to hold on to about a three car advantage over Herzog into turn number three this time they will go Herzog again goes up the hill squares it off tries to turn it down to the inside as Justin Nyer now begins to close on that battle as they head down to one and two to the south end of the racetrack good battle shaping up that is for the second or excuse me third and fourth spot down the back Nyer back into the top five in that number 17 as he'll get in front of Jacob Duper as number two machine. Field getting sped out. We got a car off the wall here on the front stretch. The 83 of Brett Sears. Not sure if he got the flat before he swatted the wall or if it was a result of swatting the wall. But Brett Sears hard into the concrete here off turn at number four. Green flag getting ready to come back out. Devendorf trying to hold this field off one more time. Pounds the throttle off turn number four. Jumps up the hill. Devendorf down to turn number one and two. Right through the middle of the speedway. Gets a good shot off turn number two. And down the back stretch he will go. Fire Swamp continues to hold that second spot. Got company now. Colby Herzog sitting two car lengths back. Herzog squares it off off turn at number four. Looks to the inside.